you know, coming out of a program like Harvard Business School or taking some of these business classes, we, we tend to get very analytical about how we select partners, right? We have this checklist in our mind. We're thinking about who our funding sources would be and what are they going to think. And while I think all that's important to be aware of, where I've seen partnerships go awry is when you let that drive it. And, you know, there's something to be said for the old gut, the old gut feel about, does this feel right? Do I want to work with this person every day for a very long time? Do I want to be with this person 24 hours in a row if things are going bad? And if that's not there, the other can't fix that. I mean, you could take the most perfectly designed ownership structure, skill set mix, et cetera, which all of the top VCs would look at and say, oh, dream team. And if the chemistry's not there, it'd be like the dream team in a sport that can't win a national championship because they just don't click. So I think you have to have the chemistry first. That can't be replaced. Then on top of that, the knowledge of maybe how to appropriately structure things makes the chemistry supercharged, right? And a lot of the structure is, again, how do you incentivize behavior, right? So there's a science and an art to the structure. Um, you know, are you incentivizing behavior where everyone has the skin in the game that's appropriate for their role? Um, are you thinking about what happens in the event that somebody's life takes them in a different direction? Is that neat and easy to undo or does it become a mess? Um, you know, those are the types of things that outside investors want to know when they come in because they don't want to inherit a mess and they don't want to invest capital and know that a good bit of that capital is going to, in a way, become inefficiently used by a partnership that doesn't work well, right? I mean, that's what they're most concerned about. I'm going to give you a dollar. I need you to make that dollar into 10. <laughs> Can you guys do that the way you're structured? That, at the end of the day, is the most important.